They're the obscure names, the unfamiliar faces. But chances are you'll get to know some of these players on game days. For instance, offensive guard Mike DeFonzo. He's taken a roundabout way to Oregon. An imposing six foot four, 295 pounds, DeFonzo had a job, did not play high school football. Then it was a couple of years to Hawaii to, as he says, goof around a while. The 25-year-old DeFonzo explains what happened next. Came back, started working, and figured out work wasn't for me and school was. So decided to go back, play football, went to JC, played for a few years. They saw me on some film, and they offered me a scholarship. Just a junior, DeFonzo gives the Ducks added depth and strength in the offensive line. Redshirt freshman Alex Molden is about to join an exclusive club, players who've started for the Ducks in their first appearance in an Oregon uniform. Molden, a cornerback, is one of the fastest players on the team, and he says he's ready to make an impact. I'm not going to hold back here. I'm not going to, uh, you know, play soft. I, I want to play like um, I want to, well, I don't want to play like a freshman. But the player with the most impact could be flanker Derek Deadweiler, a JC transfer he redshirted last year. Now Deadweiler figures to be the Ducks' best breakaway threat. Deadweiler came to Oregon with his junior college teammate, quarterback Brett Salisbury. Well, Salisbury's gone, but Deadweiler's ready to get the ball and run with it. If I see anybody who doesn't have my color jersey on, I just try to dodge them. And, you know, basically what happens is I'm always running upfield. I, ne I never learned how to run east-west. I always learned how to run, you know, north-south because I was a, a, a running back at one time. And I figured me being a running back helped me be able to catch the ball and run with it afterwards because, I, you know, I just had to, you know, that focus on getting to the end zone. Deadweiler should have plenty of chances to head for the end zone as a flanker, kick returner, and even as an occasional running back. And true freshman Tony Graziani has been a quick learner at quarterback. Keeping in mind last year's quarterback injuries, Graziani's only a hit or two from playing time. But he's found out in a hurry this is nothing like high school. It's quicker, a lot quicker, and the defenses are tougher because they disguise a lot, lot more, and, you know, you just gotta, you gotta just, you gotta read as everything's happening. There are a few other names you won't recognize. They'll introduce themselves as the season goes on. For the Oregon Football Preview Show, I'm Pat McGilvery.